Hey guys, uh, welcome to your love reading for Capricorn. What are they not telling you? What are they hiding from you for Sa uh, for Sagittarius? For uh, July 2022, um, you can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus sign. So we're going to take a look at the person that you're dealing with or the person that's on your mind. We're going to see what this person's not telling you, okay? And then we'll finish off the read to see uh, if this person will come clean towards you. So Capricorn, uh, keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates, leave the rest behind. Apply this to your own unique situation. You could switch the roles if you want. You know, this could be with a new love, a past love, a current love. This could be with a friend or family member, co-worker. So like I said, apply this to your own unique situation. If you guys haven't done so yet, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Give this video a thumbs up like this video share this video leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective capricorn people so i'm not tapping into one specific person's uh, one specific person's energies in particular i'm tapping into the collective capricorn so if you're looking for a reading specified to your unique situations and your energies i suggest you book a private personal reading with me the link for that is in the description box below okay so um Capricorn, let's get started. Tell me about the person that is on Capricorn's mind. The person that Capricorn is dealing with or the Capricorn, uh, the, the, the person that uh, uh, is... I'm messing that up. All right, let's start all over again. <laughs> Tell me about Capricorn, the person that is on Capricorn's mind or the uh, person that Capricorn is dealing with. What is this person hiding from Capricorn? What is this person hiding from Capricorn? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for July 2022. What is this person hiding from Capricorn? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for July 2022. We have the full Aries energy. You could be dealing with an Aries here. You might have Aries in your chart. We have the Five of Wands. You know, I feel like what's the issue between you and your person is that we have someone here that's, not, that's non committal. You know, someone here just wants to be footloose, fancy free here. You know, someone who, I feel like a lot of the arguments is stemming from that. Uh, what else do we have here? Nine of Wands and the Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Could be dealing with an Aries here. You might have Aries in your chart too. Seems like someone here is tired of the drama. Tired of feeling disappointed. I feel like someone here just wants to be happy. I mean, you might be disappointed towards this person or this person might be disappointed towards you or that there is regret here uh, regarding giving someone a chance. Okay? So you could be regret, like I said, you could switch the roles if you want. Uh, perhaps you're regretting giving this person a chance. This person is regretting giving you a chance. Maybe this person is seeing you as someone who is non-committal, okay? So like I said, switch the roles if you want. Uh, Leo energy with the sun card. Could be dealing with the Leo here. You might have Leo in your chart too, Capricorn. Tell me about this fool. Why is this fool card here? Why is this fool card here? You have the nine of swords, the five of wands. And the Five of Swords, you know, I feel like someone here might be losing their mind over this crazy conflict or this ar these arguments that someone here is having with somebody. Okay, so the Nine of Swords here and the Five of Swords. There's a lot of conflict here. Definitely a lot of conflict here. There's a lot of suffering here in this connection too. I mean, with the Nine of Swords here, and nine, nine of Wands, there's trauma surrounding this. We have three fives. There's a lot of changes that's happening here, Capricorn. Tell me about the Nine of Wands here. Wow, we have the tower, Aries, Scorpio energy. There's just a lot of changes happening here. Tell me about the Queen of Wands. We have the Four of Cups. Whoever this is, I feel like this person might like drama. You know, it could be a situation, yeah, you're asking this person why they're starting stuff and they don't even know. I feel like whoever you're dealing with here, this is a very angry, 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 angry person. Tell me about the Five of Cups. We have the Four of Pentacles, the Sun, and the Star. Aquarius energy. Four of Pentacles here. Whoever this is, I feel like this individual is going to keep this to themselves. The thing is, like, I mean, whatever secrets that they're hiding from you here, I mean, 
it doesn't stay hidden for a long time. It'll always have a, it, it will always have a way of coming to the surface on its own. Okay, because we have that sun card, we have the star card, and both of those cards are about, are about being seen and revealing, okay? So don't worry. Yeah, if you're like pulling your teeth, pulling your hair out, trying to figure out what this person's hiding from you, you'll find out on your own eventually, all right? Uh, let's see. Tell me if the person that Capricorn is dealing with or is on their mind, if this person will come clean towards Capricorn. Will this person come clean towards Capricorn? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for July 2022. We have the Strength card, Leo energy jumped out. Lots of Leo energy here. Ten of Pentacles, okay. Five of Pentacles and the King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Maybe you're, the, I feel like you're this king of, uh, king of Cups here, Capricorn. I mean, it could be a situation that you're feeling really lonely towards this person. Every single five is out on the table. So there's a lot of conflict here, a lot of changes. We have the lovers and the seven of pentacles. Could be a situation that we have someone here that's thinking about this relationship. With the strength card here, I don't think this person is going to come clean towards you. I feel like this person is going to be holding back. I feel like you're begging this person to tell you. But I feel like this person doesn't want to. Why is this a strength card here? Tell me about the strength card. You know, this could be an indication that this person does love you. Yeah. The strength. Not the eight of pentacles. Ten of pentacles. Three of Swords, wow. There's just a lot of heartbreak here. Yeah. There's just a lot of heartbreak in games. Could be a situation that we have someone here that's dealing with other people. If that's not in your awareness yet. You know, I, but I feel like you will find out on your own. Tell me about the Five of Pentacles. Temperance, Sagittarius, Energy, King of Cups. You know, that's Two of Swords here. Seems like someone here might be in denial. Seems like someone's guides and angels and ancestors are actually assisting you in trying to perhaps get out of this predicament that you're in with this Queen of Wands here, uh, Capricorn. All right, tell me about the lovers. You have the Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. The Seven of Pentacles here and the Two of Wands. It seems like there's another party involved. Yeah, perhaps this king has to make a decision between two people. I mean, this Queen of Pentacles, okay, so this is you right here, Capricorn. Seems like you love this king, but I feel like this king might be dealing with someone else. Could be, uh, you know, you know, the grass was greener on the other side sort of situation here. Okay, so, you know, yeah, the thing is, like, it, I feel like maybe intuitively you might be picking this up that there's something going on here, but... A lot of times you don't have to do anything. The, 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 whatever this person's hiding, it always has a way of coming up to the surface. This goes with anything, you know, when it comes to lies with anybody. So uh, Capricorn, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video, like this video. If you haven't done so yet, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will speak to you guys uh, in the next one. All right, thanks guys, bye.